Hi everyone and welcome, my name is Dora and today I'm filming my first update to Pan Matte Palette 23. So I'm working on two palettes actually. I've got my main focus palette, which is the Revolution Kombucha Kiss palette, 16 pans in there. I'm gonna insert a picture of what this looked like in the intro and then I'm gonna talk you through the, the goals that I set for myself. <laughs> right, okay, so. My first goal was to expand the pan on the sizzling. So that's the one pan in there, as you can see in that peachy shimmery shade. Um, I also wanted to hit one new pan. And then I lastly also set the goal for myself to use each shade five times, except for my problematic, scary shades as I called them. Uh, which is Energy, the Yellow Matte, and also Charcoal, that charcoal shade in the top right-hand corner. Right, so, drum roll. Hold on, why, why are we drum rolling? So, here is what my palette is looking like now. So, starting with Chaos over here, this shade I've actually used the most out of all of the other ones. I'm at 28 uses, so I have been wearing this on a regular daily basis. Every time I apply my makeup, I'm using this as my brow bone shade. This is brand new to me, so total winner. Energy, the yellow matte that I was super, super worried about in the intro. Thanks to a couple of comments, actually. So thank you so much to both Sophie Alexandra and Louise. Both of you suggested like really cool ways I could wear it. Um, and basically, yeah, I think, basically the idea is to use it as a crease shade and I have actually done that today. So including today, I have used this shade two times and I'm super happy. I feel like I did, even though that wasn't really a goal for this update, I feel quite pleased with myself that I worked out a way to use this and I actually, I think I like it. It's kind of like a sunset situation here. I had a dream last night that I was at a party and it was the year 2000, so I channeled that vibe. Uh, anyway, right, so the next shade here, Spice, that peachy matte shade, I used nine times. Then charcoal um, here I have used once. So I think that's kind of cool. I didn't, you know, I had the goal to not even need to, needing to touch these, but did, so yay. Uh, light Up, I have used 17 times, I think exclusively as my inner corner highlight. I haven't used it on my lid yet. Then Heat, uh, I've used twice. Passion, that pink, slightly shimmery one, I've used five times. Fiery, I have used once. Blazing, I have used once as well. Sizzling, I have used nine times. And I hope you can see that the pan has expanded a little bit. Not too bad. Rebel, I have used two times. Scorching, I've used once. And then heating up, I have used twice. Flames, I've used twice. All or nothing, I have used four times. And then finally, the dark side, I have used five times yes so this may mm, i need a calculator for this i have used all of these shades a total of 91 times and even though i didn't hit all of them five times as i said i would or should um i'm not too upset about that because on average i have dipped into each shade 5.69 times so I I will be nice with myself and consider it a goal met, sort of. Um, I didn't hit one new pan. I mean, who am, who am I kidding? Um, but I think, you know, looking at chaos, there's a slight bit of a dip starting to form. Um, but I'm using a very, very, very soft brush. And I'm only very delicately dipping in there. So... Yeah, I think this will be a long time before I see pan on that. Light up as well, which I have used 17 times. So this was 28 times, this was 17 times. Again, I can see a dip starting to form, but I don't think I'm that close to hitting another pan just yet. Um, but 
I am wearing it on a daily basis. In each look that I do, I am incorporating at least these two. And usually I'm wearing one of the mats to buff out the crease now. Today, for example, I've used Energy Chaos Light Up and Sizzling as well, just dabbed over my inner corner. So let's set some more low key goals for next time. I'm not gonna set myself the goal of hitting pan next time, but rather I wanna just keep working away consistently. So I want to continue using Chaos and Light Up on a daily basis. Um, I want to also use sizzling a minimum of 10 times just to expand that pan, make it even more juicy. And then I also want to use each and every shade two times minimum. I think that is more realistic. There were a few shades that I only used once. Charcoal, fiery and blazing and scorching were only used once. So that's four of them. So I think, yeah, if I can get all of them on two minimum, that would be great. Um, yeah, and then hopefully, hopefully, we can see a pan in the next, next update. So that would be in the April update. Yeah, all right. And then we're gonna get into spring. So obviously it'll be like, much more appropriate palette perhaps. All right, let's move on to my side palette. I didn't set any goals for myself, but um, I definitely will be doing that for next time. So that first shade here, they don't have names. So shade number one, I have used nine times. I think it definitely looks a little bit, tiny little bit less messy in there. And then the second shade I used twice. Shade number six, I have used 10 times. Shade number seven, I haven't used at all. Shade number 11 is my most used shade out of this palette. I have used 14 times. And then shade number 12, the last and darkest one, I have used 11 times. I think like I am slowly getting somewhere with this. Um, I'm gonna set some goals for next time. So first of all, I wanna use that deepest and darkest shade here, seven times minimum. So that's one week's worth of progress. Yeah. It works really nicely with one of the shades that I am currently panning in my Pandas eyeshadows. So this on the outer corner, yes, I'm into that. And then my second goal is to actually focus on shade number seven, which I haven't used this past month. And I want to focus on hitting side pan. And I don't know if you can see, can you see that? Is that just like a squiggly line or is it part of something like an official imprint? Cause it's like a plastic pan or is it just a, I don't know. I'm curious. I want to find out. I need to know what is this thing? So I really want to like hit side pan to expose that in however many uses that's gonna take me. So those are my goals for the Maybelline one. I think to me, quarter one is really about, and I mean, I'm talking about this like I'm so experienced with this, but the way I see it is that these first few months, I'm going to be focusing on just laying a really good foundation for myself and that is in this palette to just maybe hit the odd side pan, like I said, expand some of those pans so that I can hopefully finish some of these shades then later on in the year. And same with the Kombucha Kiss. I think if I work away at all of them a little bit, some of them more than a little bit, then hopefully they'll be like pans, 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 pans galore in the spring. That would be cool. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for more updates and I hope you're having a lovely rest of your day or night, wherever you are. Sending you so much love. Bye-bye.